Promoting other teams' chances over his own is nothing new for Roberto Mancini. The Manchester City boss used the deflection tactic to perfection last year, insisting Neighbours United had the title wrapped up until Sergio Aguero's stoppage time strike handed them the honours on the final day. The new season is still young, but on the eve of his side's clash with Arsenal at the Etihad, it appears Mancini's penchant for mind games hasn't debated. I think that's Arsenal can compete for the title this, this year. I don't know if uh, they are better than last year, but uh, I think that they have less pressure than last year. They lose two or three important players, but I'm sure that they play for, uh, for the title. It's been a tough week for the defending Premier League champions. They come into the Arsenal game on the back of a painful trip to the Bernabeu in the Champions League. City led with five minutes remaining, only to lose 3-2, sparking some heated words between goalkeeper Joe Hart and his Italian manager in the media. No, no, no. Uh, also because uh, Joe didn't say nothing. But uh, I don't know. I don't remember who asked me this, and I did. I I said that I was agree with him, but Joe should do his job like uh, all the other players, finish, but I don't have any problem with Joe, uh, with anyone. If that wasn't problem enough for Mancini, he's also had to face rumours of a rift with Italian striker Mario Balotelli. Reports suggested the pair had fallen out and that was the reason he was left out of the squad for the Real Madrid match. No, 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 I want to say this about this because uh, it's totally, it's totally uh, false what uh, someone uh, uh, wrote yesterday is not true. Uh, Mario went on the stand only because we decided to play with only Tevez. Uh, I can bring with me in the bench three, three strikers, only for this reason. And Mario is a uh, player like the other players, sometimes can go in the bench, can go in the stand. City will hope to put any problems behind them when they take on Arsenal at the Etihad Stadium on Sunday.